welcome back to my channel southern yankee uh, my name is terry if you're new here welcome so happy to have you take a minute and hit the subscribe button below and also hit the notification bell because if you don't you don't always get notified of my videos um youtube's been a little wonky lately i've had people telling me like that they haven't gotten notified luckily my name's easy southern yankee if you need to kind of google me or you know search for my name and find me so hopefully you guys are having a fantastic day i feel like i just did one of these unbaggings, unboxings, unbaggings, it's a bag, uh, we have our fashion crate to do today. Now, if you did not get see my January fashion crate unbagging, <laughs> it's so weird because I'm used to saying unboxing, go and check it out because I do have a contest running. They're going to do a premium box of the December box for one of my lucky subscribers. So one of you is going to have the opportunity to win a premium box for December. So certainly go and check that video out and it'll tell you in there in that video how to enter into the video. So this actually came super, super duper quick. I got it. I think I got it on like the 29th of January. I had just done the one for January and before February even hit, this one was here. So they were like on top of getting this out. Um, so I have popped it open because this little sucker, sometimes it's really easy to open and sometimes it's really hard to open. Um, there are two different levels of the subscription. You can get a premium, which is what I got, and that is, I think, the $49.99 one. You can also get one step below, which usually is like two or three items less than the main one, and I think that's $29.99 if you want to check it out. I will have my code below so that you guys can sign up for this. This subscription is pretty cool. It, it I think sometimes at first I was a little like, oh, it's... It's sort of catering to a younger crowd. Um, and I think it does in some sense, but I think they were hearing the feedback. They had so many of us that were in their 30s and 40s subscribing to us to, to Fashion Crate and saying, hey, some of this stuff is not usable for somebody that's a little bit older in, in their lives. And so I've noticed their clothing choices and things are becoming more universal and items like last month, we got this really cute cardigan and a really cute t-shirt that I absolutely love. And um, so I'm hoping that we have some awesome things in here too, but I am seeing them change. So what can you get in Fashion Crate for your $49.95? You can get beauty items, skincare items, makeup items, clothing items. There's usually clothing in every box. And I would say size up, go up one more size than what you normally do. If you are a small, go to a medium. If you're a medium, go to a large. Now, I think they also do carry some women's plus sizes. So you can now select that if you're in those sizes. And you can also get the um, like gift cards and jewelry. It, it really can be a mix match of anything. It, it, it really, I would say, is centered around like beauty and fashion and lifestyle. But I've gotten things for the laundry. I've gotten lint rollers. I've gotten all kinds of neat things in here, like a purse lint roller that I really love. It's in my purse right now. All right. So let me get in here and find, looks like we have two kind of, oops, oops and it all falls out. That's what you got to watch. All right. So this doesn't look like as big of a one, two, three, four, five items. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven items. All right. I have had a problem with things missing from here. One, two, three, four. So I might be missing some stuff in here again. So I'm gonna have to contact them. This is the about the third time they're having some issues with these bags and with things missing from them because they're very easy. They're trying to figure out some sort of new packaging. I will say they've been really good at resending stuff out when stuff has been missing, um, but it is a little bit annoying to have things missing because I can't really show you guys all of what's in here. Um, so let's let's get to it. So this stuff I'm going to show you first is goes in the essential and the premium box, and it looks like I might be missing. Or maybe I'm just missing two things. Nope. I think I'm missing two things from what it looks like. Okay, so let's get into here. So the first thing this... Oh, wait, nope. Here they are. They're here. Good. I take back everything I said. They were hiding in the... They were hiding in this. I, I was going to say, I don't know how they pack stuff. They, they, they get so much in those little bags. The first item I'm about to show you is a delicate ivy floral blouse, and it's a $45 value. So sorry about the noise. I know it's so loud. 
I saw this when I just opened it and the, I liked the pattern of this and the colors in this a lot. This is, looks really neat for spring. So I hope that it fits and I hope that it's cute. It looks small. Um, this is in a size large and it is by Love, Love Richie, Love Richie. And it's very pretty. So it is, it's got a little, what an interesting neckline. So it's got the design, but it's real heavy. The design is really heavy sort of on the side. And it comes down and you have all these little flowers and then it comes down and you have like your full garden, the bottom. And it looks like there are little buttons. Yep, and some of them are unbuttoned. There are little buttons going all the way down. We'll see how I do with those. When you're big busted, that can be an issue. <laughs> and the, it's got wide, oh, this is so cute. Oh, I hope this fits me. I wonder if they do exchanges. That's something I don't know because I feel like, I feel like this looks a little bit small in like the top area but the bottom area and all looks fine so so cute i really like the the sleeves and i love how the graduation of the green and the flowers and then just the little buds kind of flying up very pretty so this is a 45 dollar value right there you just about got the value of your box so it says it's this adorable floral blouse is wonderfully delicate and beautiful it's made for lovely occasions featuring a beautiful floral print in lavender light pink green and white this delicate look is so easy to love the bodice features a necktie paired with long sleeves now you have something to wear on valentine's day so cute maybe that's why they got this out early was for valentine's day that could be a possibility all right the next thing we got i always love when gift boxes you know or bags or subscriptions send me socks i love socks and these are so stinking cute these are cute heart ankle socks and they are lightweight featuring a heart-shaped cushion tab that protects your heel and they are three dollar and fifty cent value so here they are you've got your little they just go on and then you've got in the back your little heel here you've got your little heart those are cute and I just always need socks. I don't know about you guys. I always need socks. How do you guys fold your socks? Do you tie them together? Do you like roll them up Marie Kondo style? Do you, this is what I do. I don't know why, but I fold them like this and then they're always together. And that's how I put them in the, it, that's how I try to remember when I take them off to throw them in the laundry, but then I have to undo them when I put them in the load. But that way I know all my socks, mine have pairs in that particular load unless something falls out from the washer to the dryer or whatever. Robert, however, just throws the socks in there. So then he's like, I don't have any pairs. I was like, you need to do this. You need to do this. So curious how you guys fold your socks. Let me know. All right. So, and I am showing you the items that are in both the essential and premium box first, and I'll show you the um, premium box item second. Okay. So the next item is a love bracelet. Now we have received these before, um, but we have gotten one in, I think, a pretty like teal, turquoise, teal color. This one is um, Tenderness, Sensuality, and Unconditional Love, Canoyo. The Canai or Canio, Canio Love Signature Bracelet is made of genuine rose quartz beads. As with its name, the heart stone, as it is often called, is a stone of love within oneself and others. A crystal of tenderness and sensuality, it's a powerful stone stimulating sensual imagination as well as encouraging unconditional love. This accessory is an instant reminder to love yourself and hold your loved ones dear and close. And this is a $24 value and it's beautiful. Um, and I have my blue one upstairs and I love rose quartz. I just think it's such a gorgeous and it is a stone of love whenever you're needing to attract love into your life you should uh, you should put some rose quartz by your bedside or carry it around with you in your pocket um, so here it is it's really beautiful and it's pink it's a different shade of pink so we'll wear that today and you can see I have my necklace my necklace and my pink um, cardigan on for my stitch fix. I did end up keeping everything in that stitch fix. I did make a couple of exchanges. I exchanged down in the dolman. They didn't have a size up in the polka dot top. So, but that was a petite medium. So I, they did have a, oh, just a regular woman's petite. So I sized to that, hoping that would give us a little more room for the back and stuff. Part of my problem with those shirts is I just have like a very big curve in my back. So everything, so it wasn't really pulling. It was pooling. Like the material Material was pooling there making ridges and that's like what I always have so I don't know if it'll make it any different in that size but that's the only that's the only next size that they had so all right so rose hip oil blotter paper this is ten dollars 
I saw these in the preview. So these are hypoallergenic blotting papers in Rose with Rose Hip Oil. Remove dirt buildup, unwanted oil shine, and perspiration from skin for a more clear matte complexion. I may give these to my daughter because oh, and it says it has the oil contains antioxidants with which fight free radicals and responsible for aging. Freshen up without disturbing your makeup. Ten bucks. Um, but I don't really have oily skin. I do get, sometimes I get a little bit in my T-zone. All right, are we fuzzy there? And I'll get it like here a little, but I really don't. So she might like this. I gave her those little acne dots that you put on. I don't know if she's used them yet, but because um, she just had a pretty bad breakout. But there they are. So they're by My Couture. Okay, so that's cool. All right, the next thing is by Trifle Cosmetics. And I think we got a palette by this company before. This is so cute. All right, so this is, hold on. Okay, sorry, my son came home. So this is by Trifle Cosmetics. It's Magic Frosting Liquid Gleam. Now, when I first saw this, I thought it was a lipstick. It's not. So let me show you this. It's the cutest little packaging. Let's see if I can get it to zo to zoom in on it. It doesn't really want to, it doesn't really want to focus. Is that better? There we go. So you see it's got a little cupcake, a green weird cupcake. Um, the, so what this is, is you mix this with your moisturizer or your, you could do it with your foundation. And it says, add more drops to your recipe while cooking up a dessert worthy look. Use it on its own for a touch of highlighting shimmer. The formula is sweetened with ripe blueberry and plum apps extracts to help keep your skin firm and supple throughout the day. And it's $17. I am so interested in getting into this. It's vegan, no mineral oil, no parabens, no fluff of fates. <laughs> I don't know how to say that word. No gluten, hypoallergenic, non comedogenic and 100% cruelty free. So this is the second time, like I said, we got a Trifle Cosmetics palette from them. And I'm wondering if this is like a new brand trying to make it into the market. And I love that it's cruelty free and that it's got no bad stuff for us. So let's see. Okay, so this is like a lot like the Stila Drops or the Cover FX, as you can see here. So I'm gonna put, I have highlighter on, but I'm gonna put a little bit. This is that stuff usually, okay, so it's kind of thick right off the bat. Um, it doesn't have, you know how Stila, or, or, oh, it's really thick. You see that? Um, the cover effects they're almost like liquidy this is this is quite thick i'm not sure how i feel about that it's not a drop now i it makes me kind of wonder if maybe it was like a a little bit of a better consistency maybe because we did have like this came when we were having like 18 degree weather and maybe the weather sort of messed it up man the color is gorgeous guys the color is stunning. It's just a very thick formula. So if anybody else got this bag, tell me if yours was the same way, if, if it's thick like this, because you can kind of see it's clumpy and thick. Not a big fan of that. Now it seems like the formula is still working. Now I can't see how well, maybe I'm gonna get in regular light and it's gonna look ridiculous. Let's see if we can zoom in. It looks like it needs to be blended a little. I don't know. I don't know. I think it, so that sounds fun. I mean, well, that'll be fun to play with, but um, I don't remember if I liked the Trifle Cosmetics palette. I'm not sure that I used it a whole lot. I don't think I really loved it. If I'm, like, I don't think it compared very well to some other brands that I've tried. So, um, and this one, is, it is kind of like a frosting consistency, so maybe that's what it's supposed to be like. Um, and if that's the case, it, it's working just fine. So, but beautiful color. What color is that actually, does it say? Wow Glace, G-L-A-C-E. Okay, and that's a $24 value. All right, so that's everything that came in the regular bag. Now, if you go up and you get the $49.95 bag, you're going to get two extra items. And the first one is this luxurious gold passport holder by My Couture. 
and you're going to get, I think there was two colors you could get. Oh, there's three. You could get either like a pink, a gold, or a silver. Um, this is fits your makeup or skincare papers, credit card, and ID, and it's $18. Keep your travel essentials snug and secure. So let's take a look. It says there's a $20 value on the, There's a $20 tag on here and an $18 value on here. So I got the gold, which I like. Pink would have been better, but I got gold. And, and I do travel from time to time where I need a passport um, holder. Usually our hotel will give us like those big, huge, chunky ones. But I would rather have something small and compact like this. So, okay, so here it is. And you just, it looks like it's leather. And you're just going to put your, your papers and your passport in here. And then it has, this is cute, your little closure right there. So that's cute. I like that. All right. The last item we got is the Softest Mauve Scarf. And this is a $48 value. All right here, this doubles the bag value for you. I'll try this on too. All right. This is by Seal Collection. I need to wear scarves more. I'm not, I don't wear them very often. And I think I don't wear them very often because I'm big up here. So what happens is they end up in my face. That's the whole problem with them. All right, so this is, here it is. This is just a, it's got a little bit of fringe. It's, and it is soft. It is absolutely soft. And it has a, so you could, There, that's cute. Maybe not with this outfit, but it is cute. So there you go. I just covered up my microphone, so hopefully you can hear me. Yeah, see, now this I would wear. This one I don't feel is so much in my face, and it's actually quite comfortable, and it's very soft. I think this would keep you warm. This would be a nice addition um, on chilly days. Hopefully, because Punk's a Tony Phil, what did he see his shadow? We are not supposed to have. We're supposed to have an early spring, so here's to hoping we do, because... Um, we're actually having spring like weather today. We have like 70 degrees outside. I went outside and it was warm out. It's been warm all week. And then of course, last week we had 18 degrees. Um, that's why everybody in our house is sick. I think we're just, the weather is like, it's like, you know, super cold and then 70 degrees and you can be out in a t-shirt the next day. It's very strange. You know, the dogs don't know what to do. So anyways, guys, I'm going to let you go. I hope you enjoyed this un Bag bagging. See, when I try to say box and bag, it doesn't work. When you try to say together, uh, fashion crate. And if you have not done so already, go check the other video out and get yourself into the contest for that because I'll be picking the winner on the 23rd and that is going to be the December one. I want to get that out to you as quick as possible. We might be closing it a little bit early. Um, fashion crate might want me to so make sure that you get over there and you i think it's a like comment subscribe and then i think you have to follow fashion crate as well they are on instagram and i think they're on facebook you can follow them on facebook or instagram too so that is all i'll see you guys in the next video be sure if you like these kind of videos to give it a thumbs up for me i appreciate that so much i was just looking i got my analytics yesterday we got I think we got something like a hundred and I don't know, 118 new subscribers last month. We had something like 240,000 hours of or, or minutes of, of watch time last month. 600, I want to say it was like 641 comments, something like that. It was really neat to sort of get my stats for the for the month, which it was a good month. We had a little bit of a stall down period, and now we're back up to speed. But I highly attribute that to the fact that I, I had mono and I had hyperthyroid. And so, guys, I just know I was not up to my normal peppy self. I wasn't putting out the kind of content in the same energy level that I had been. I just didn't, I didn't know what was wrong with me. So that now that we know, I'm and I'm, I'm on the mend. I am doing better. I still have not went to the doctor. I know you guys are going to tell me when's your doctor appointment. She's coming up. Um, it took a, it's a specialist. It took a little bit of time to get in there, but I do have um, the mono is now cleared up. I went through like I don't know how many three four months of that, and that I didn't know I had it. 
So that was fun. <laughs> anyway, so hopefully things are back on track here. You're going to see a lot of good content and a little bit more of my normal self. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Please comment below your favorite item from this um, bag and I'll see y'all soon. Bye guys.